hello, how are you? Jason Jenkins, and this is Emma Mae Jenkins. She asked me right before her 19th birthday a couple of months ago, Dad, can we sing a song together? And I said, great, I'd love to sing a song with you, sweetie. We need help. And that person that's going to help us is Dove Award winning <laughs> Clay Cross. Well, the Dove Award winning part is not necessary, but, but thank you. I, I love you guys. I really do. When you called, I was like, what are you talking about? Yeah, man, let's, let's get together and sing and play. And mm -hmm. what a gift it is to be able to share that with, with friends. So, uh, Love you, you, I love you, Jenkins. Is. Yes, <laughs> yes. He's going to make this song a lot more gooder than <laughs> me just doing it with him. So, the song is Oh Praise the Name. And basically, the first verse that came to my mind when thinking about this song was 1 Corinthians 15. And it says in verse 1, it says that I want to remind you of the gospel and that you have taken your stand. By this gospel, you are saved. And whatever he's about to share, he, he says that I pass this on to you as of first importance. And what he shares is that Jesus died for your sins and that he was buried in a tomb and that on the third day, he rose from the grave. And then he appeared, appeared to Peter and the 12 and then to 500 more basically saying they're alive you can go ask him if he rose from the grave so when we think our life is just so burdened with pain and anger and hatred and all the things going on in this world our Jesus rose from the grave and he's coming back to get us one day to rescue us from that pain that was the first verse that came to my mind what about you then yeah I I thought of John 3 16 and I just wanted to share this with y'all because it says for God so loved the world but I want you to put your name in there because God is a personal God wanting a relationship with you. For God so loves you that he sent his one and only son that if you believe in him, you shall never perish but have mm -hmm. eternal life. Mm -hmm. God, he doesn't want heaven without you in it. He loves you. He loves you so much that he would send the most precious thing to die so that he could have you. But it doesn't end there. Because Jesus rose, you were made for such a time as this. And today you can rise up in that freedom with him, knowing that you're here for an eternal purpose. And the things of this earth, the chaos of this world, it can and it will pass away. In this world, we will have trouble. But take heart, because Jesus has overcome the world. I cast my mind. To Calvary, where Jesus bled and died for me. I see his wounds, his hands, his feet, my Savior on that cursed tree.